Well, Jen, when we first arrived here in Hampton around 2, 3 o'clock, it was nothing but heavy snow coming down. Now, as you may be able to tell, that has since switched over to rain with a few flakes. We'll go ahead and give you a live look at the roads, at least here along the main strip. You can see the blacktop. It's just covered in some slush and ice. However, the side roads, those are still caked in a good amount of snow, so something to keep in mind there. The biggest issue right now is with the wind. Uh, the wind you can see up in the trees and some of the signs shaking. That may be able to bring some potential for power outages. However, right now, uh, there are no power outages to report, so some good news there. Also good news is on the tide front. We did have a chance to speak with Hampton's fire chief who said high tide was around noontime today. He said that there were no major issues uh, to report, but the big concern though is what happens later on in the evening. He says right around midnight is when the tide will pick it back up again, and that is when we are expecting the strongest winds to hit the coast here, uh, anywhere between 30 to 50 miles per hour, and the fire chief says with the rising tide and those strong winds that could likely create some potential uh, for flooding, but he says he has extra crews on hand in case anything goes wrong, and they are watching certain spots that are prone to flooding. So right now, so far so good here along the coast. No reports, no injuries uh, to report on, and right now no power outages and no flooding. So good news there, but of course, crew said they will be keeping a watchful eye as things continue. We're live here in Hampton Beach. I'm Tim Callery, WMUR News 9.